My name is Catherine, and I study parasitic wasps at Ohio State's Museum of Biological Diversity. Today, I'm going to talk to you about insect collections and how a scientist like me can use a collection of insect specimens for research. First, what is an insect collection? Insect collections are like libraries, but instead of books, they hold examples of the different kinds of insects that are found in a particular place. Scientists can visit collections at museums and universities to examine the insect specimens that are safely kept there. They may also borrow specimens from a collection so that they can spend more time with the insects looking at them and studying them. When entomologists look at insect specimens from a collection, they can learn many different things. Most commonly though, scientists use collections to discover new species and study the relationships between species. Some scientists also study insect specimens to help them develop new technology, like robots. Because insects are some of the most successful animals in the world, by closely examining preserved specimens, scientists can understand the form and function of insect bodies. That knowledge can then be applied to develop new products, like robots, that work like insects and benefit people. Finally, scientists can also use the information about where and when insects were collected in the past to watch for changes in distribution and abundance of insect species over time. We can study how climate change affects insect populations simply by comparing where the insect species in a collection were caught 20 years ago versus last year. However, each insect collection is different and no one collection has representatives of every kind of insect. Some collections specialize on insects in a place, for example, a national park or Ohio. Other collections have specimens from all over the world, but they specialize in one group of insects. In order to keep learning more about insects, we need a large network of collections so that we can build a clear picture of the insects around our world. Thanks for watching and good luck making your own insect collection.